Hi, my name is Marc Bauer. I'm the master chef at the International Culinary Center here at the Events Kitchen. Today, I would like to show you how to reheat a lobster tail. To reheat the lobster tail, you will need salt, pepper, some thyme, tarragon if you have, a container to put the lobster tail on, of course the tail, some melted butter and a pastry brush. So to properly store it, first we're going to put butter everywhere. So we put butter on the bottom, uh, the lobster tail, a little bit of butter on top, and coat it with herbs. If you have thyme, that goes very well with it. A tarragon goes well as well. Just a whole, a whole sprig is fine. And I have a, a piece of clove that works, and your tail. I want to make sure that it's not too high so that it can heat up properly. So I will coat it with butter. Um, it's very important that the lobster is cold so that the butter seals, congeals on the lobster. Now that the lobster is coated with butter, you can wrap it up with plastic, store it in the refrigerator until reheating. So it's the next day and we're ready to reheat the lobster. So preheat the oven at 350. Of course, if you don't have a huge oven like this to, uh, to heat up, you can always use a toaster oven for a small portion like that. Uh, preheat the toaster oven though, probably at least 10 minutes. Uh, at 350, 370. And remove the plastic wrap, put it in the oven. In this oven, five minutes. In the toaster oven, probably like seven minutes uh, will work. Five minutes have gone by. If you use a toaster oven, it will take about seven minutes. Now you're ready to eat your lobster, maybe a little lemon juice uh, or a little tomato sauce to which you add uh, brown butter to it. Um, and enjoy. This has been Marc Bauer. That's how you reheat lobster tail.